Hi folks, Mike Schramke with Larry Stove Sand Equipment, America's largest selling coyote dealer and Tennessee's only five paw premier dealer. Today is January 23rd, 2020 and a good time to talk about backhoes. Coyote offers backhoes for everything we sell with the exception of the PX series, the really big one. And uh, a really, really excellent line of powerful, reliable backhoes. From the smallest model that goes on the CS tractor to uh, all the way up to the RX series tractor, you can buy a backhoe and uh, you, can, you can dig to your heart's content. I think what's, uh, what's, so, what's so awesome about our, our equipment, even the smallest series, the, uh, the SB2410, which goes on the CS series, the subcompact tractor, uh, it has a uh, bucket digging force of 2,100 pounds. Picture 2,100 pounds versus what you can do with your foot on a shovel. Give you some kind of idea. Uh, we sell a lot of that series, the CS series with a backhoe to uh, electricians, plumbers, you know, people that need to do under, underground uh, trenches and cables, folks that do French drains, um, or homeowners that uh, want to remove rocks. And, uh, you know, I, in fact, I used one at my house for a uh, French drain project. It was really, really excellent, uh, magnificent machine. Certainly, the, the most common backhoe that we sell, the biggest seller for us, is the SB2475L. It doesn't tell you anything, but it goes on the CK10 series tractor. And um, whether you buy a CK2610, 3510, 4010, they all use the same backhoe. They all have the same hydraulic operating pressure because the um, that series of tractor all has the same PTO pump or hydraulic pump rather so if uh, if your main use is uh, in buying a tractor is is a backhoe you'll get the exact same performance out of a 2610 as you would a 4010 it doesn't uh, it it has nothing to do with the horsepower it has to do with the uh, hydraulic output and uh, those have a bucket digging force of 2800 pounds and then on the series, the DK, NX, RX, they all use the Coyote KB2485 backhoe. And uh, that's, a, that's a backhoe that'll reach out eight and a half feet and uh, has a, uh, and I am referring to notes here, has a digging force of 3,748 pounds. Uh, really magnificent. And uh, the performance there again on, uh, on an, RX and a, and a DK, you know, uh, a large frame, compact DK, some people would consider it a small conventional, all the way up to, a, you know, the 8,000 pound RX, they use the same backhoe, and uh, you'll get the same performance. So um, it has, performance on a backhoe has more to do with the, uh, with the tractor, that noise you hear is Charlie rooting up his, uh, his mat, Charlie, don't do that. I'm trying to find a comfortable position. Um, but anyway, it has uh, less to do with the uh, size of the tractor and the horsepower of the tractor as it does the backhoe itself. So uh, the performance uh, will, you know, be excellent no matter which one you, you choose. Um, what I'd like to do is uh, go outside. I lined them all up. I've got, I'm missing uh, the, the NX series because uh, we had, well, we had two and then yesterday... John sold one. Um, but uh, let's go outside and uh, take a look at, 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 at the lineup. Uh, take a peek. As you start contemplating the purchase of a new tractor, perhaps you'd like to have a backhoe, perhaps you, need, you know that you need a backhoe, or perhaps you think maybe someday in the future you'd like to add a backhoe to the tractor that you buy today. And uh, we, can, uh, we can work with you on any of that. There are brands of tractors that uh, if not equipped with uh, their version of a backhoe prep package from the factory, 
you, you need to decide today because you can't add a backhoe in the future. All of our tractors can uh, be outfitted with a backhoe right now or a year from now or whenever. The, uh, there's no permanent uh, modifications that are made on the tractor and, and mostly because of the subframe system and the hydraulic system. The, uh, the subframe, which we're giving you kind of a look here as John runs along the, uh, the rail, you'll see that it mounts under the engine in the front and then towards the back these two large indentations and to mount the uh, backhoe you'll just back the tractor over these rails and it snaps into place. As far as the hydraulic system it uses regular rear hydraulics for the tractor and simply plugs in. So it's just that simple. You can add a backhoe at any time and by making it that easy to install your backhoe when you need it, it's equally easy to remove the backhoe. You set the, uh, the outriggers down to support the weight of the entire unit, pull these two pins, the hydraulic lines, and simply pull away. You'll note that on all of our tractors, with the exception of the little guy, the CS, the three-point hitch stays on the tractor. It doesn't interfere with the operation, the hookup, the removal, anything. It stays right there. So that's really a, a time saver and, a, and a, it's a pain in the neck, believe me, if you have to constantly uh, install and reinstall, uninstall the, uh, the three-point hit. Um, definite, uh, definite advantage. If, if, um, while they're not inexpensive, they're not nuts either. So let us figure you a quote. Tell us what you want to do. I can tell you that on the CS model, John, kind of swing with me a little bit. The CS model, this is the CS 2210, 22 horsepower, four-wheel drive, as all of our tractors are. And uh, at first blush, some folks would look at this and say, well, my goodness, what can it dig? And to, uh, to kind of give an illustration, one day John and I went out to the uh, back pasture and decided just to dig a hole. We didn't look for a soft spot or anything else. We just started, or not we, John started digging. It's, uh, it's truly a remarkable machine in what it, can, uh, what it can actually do. Sell a lot of these to plumbers and electricians uh, running, uh, you know, lines through the ground and then, you know, footers on, on houses, septic workers, uh, septic tanks. Uh, they do a great job on that. The biggest seller would be the CK10 series with the KB2475L backhoe. And uh, it's a great all-around backhoe uh, for people with, uh, with a farm or a guy that wants to uh, uh, build a barn and put footers down. And again, running lines. Um, sold one to a guy that did an entire swimming pool with it. It's just a, a great all-around backhoe. The larger ones, um, more construction-oriented or heavier farm use, uh, folks that... Uh, want to, you know, if you have horses or cattle, occasionally they die. And, uh, you know, if you need the ability to, uh, to be able to, you know, uh, dispose of the uh, large animals or something like that, they work great for that. And the RX series um, is typically somebody that does a combination of construction and agriculture. Again, um, easily in mere moments, the backhoe comes off and whatever three-point implement that uh, you're going to be using uh, goes on. Uh, just, a, just a great setup. Give us a call um, or email us. I've got two stores around Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, right now we're standing in the, uh, at the Springfield store, which is slightly north of Nashville. And the phone number is 615-382-5605. The uh, Murfreesboro store, which is a little bit southeast of Nashville, is 615-956-0334. And uh, 
you can give us a call or email us here at uh, sales at LSE Tractor, like Larry Stosan Equipment, lsetractor.com, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll give you a heck of a quote. on. Uh, tell us what you want to do with the machine besides, you know, how much you need to dig with the backhoe. Tell us what else you'll be doing with it so that, you know, we can make sure that it's a, a tractor that'll operate whatever implements you want as well. Um, and let us let us make a quote for you, a couple quotes, um, and I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. These are incredible machines, um, the backhoes, that are mounted on very, very nice tractors. So, again, my name's Mike Schramke with Larry Stove Sand Equipment, Nashville, Tennessee, and give us a call or email, and I'd love to quote you one. Thanks for watching my video. <laughs> Big down, big down, and find faith when you're close to the edge or with a gun to your head.